I think in general it needs a little bit of art and a little bit of science. And we live with so much data right now. We have so many tools at our disposal to help make something as strategic and as targeted as possible. But we have to marry that with some gut as well. And I think the more data that gets involved, the more we have to make a concerted effort to look at things like what do we think is going to be right, what content speaks to us, who loves the brand and can speak to that as well. And that should, that should evoke itself in the video. Well, it's happening so fast and technology is moving so quickly and um, data is growing so much that it's hard to hold all of it in, right? And, and to make sure that we have a grasp on all of it. Um, the way that it will manifest itself in the market is a whole different story. And I think right now we're at a crucial point because it's at the point where we're able to actually manipulate data to serve a certain message at a certain time to somebody and for that to resonate with someone in either a good way or a bad way. Right? And the bad way is, this is creepy, how do they know this? I didn't consent. And the consent piece is a very tricky question. A lot of people, in my opinion, don't know to the full extent of what they've consented to. They think that maybe they've, maybe they've consented to one thing, even though the fine print explains in great detail all of the complex ways that their data may be used and can be used. Um, and that's why they're angry, and that's why we hear it, and that's why it's being brought up to, uh, you know, the government to, to try to make sense of it. And that'll be key going forward is, will the industry have some form of self-regulation like what we saw in, in the movie industry in the 30s, for example? Or will there be some sort of um, multiple party solution like a bit of government, a bit of self-regulation, and consumers will have a huge vote in how that, how that manifests? I think it's too early to tell if GDPR has been effective, but I think the intent of GDPR is, is what's headed in the right direction, which is to say that people's privacy and data matters. And that was something that, at least in terms of data, we didn't know what the value was to that yet. And we may still not fully understand the value of it today. Um, but the idea that there's governments trying to create solutions around it and restrictions, I think is very good. Um, even if the actual regulations itself work or don't work, is something that we need to work through. It's okay to write a piece of regulation as long as there's some sort of form for adjusting it and molding it to make it better. Well, there may be a moment where, uh, you know, we take a couple steps backward in the right direction, right? Where we simplify the way that we plan media and serve video out there. And maybe there's elements that help commoditize themselves in the future. Right now, there's just so many different ad formats, so many different ways that you can target the same person or the same group of people that you have to figure it out. Um, and if we commoditize some of those environments or the way that we serve media, that may actually help us. It'll, it'll simplify a very complex environment. I think the industry should continue to be very consumer focused and we should continue to extend a handout to consumers at all points. They should be invited to events like this so that they can weigh in from a consumer standpoint and that we can take their feedback in real time and change products. I think the people that do it the best, that create the most seamless way of serving ads to people in a way that doesn't make them feel like they've been taken advantage of, um, are going to be the most successful. And I think Apple, uh, leaning into privacy is an example of a company trying to brand an effort and if that effort is successful if their stock price goes up if people rally behind that positioning I think that's a template for other companies in the industry as a whole to say yeah we're going to lean in and be very consumer first as we move forward and leaning more into data.